You know, guys, it's funny. I got on here, you know, I got done with my English call, and I, I actually, I guess I do have an assignment for English, but I got done with that, and I said, um, I said, I'm going to use the bathroom, and then I'm going to come back in here and look at, um, and look at what I have to do. And I have, like, nothing to do. Well, I mean, technically I have things to do. I had a question of the day for math, and, but the question of the day was, what, are, what do you plan to do with your nice weather outside? And I said, okay, well, I guess I'll go for a walk. And, you know, as you can see, it's, eh, it's supposed to get maybe 60, 61 today. So I guess it's pretty good. And, I don't know, hopefully it's not too windy. It seems like, it, it does seem like there's always some sort of, like, qualifier whenever it's, like, sunny and warm. And so it's like, oh, it's sunny and warm, but it's windy. So hopefully it's not. Maybe it'll... Maybe it'll be a nicer day. So then I just have to take pictures from my walk and put it on my biology thing for today. So, um, so yeah, I guess not too much to do. And other than that, we have some guided questions for English. I guess I gotta do that. Poppy's just relaxing, right, Poppy? She's, it, it, ever since I cleared off this chair, she's, she's digging this chair. All right, Pop. And folks, it's just as I expected. It's fairly breezy out here. So as I, as I said earlier, there's always has to, there always has to be some sort of qualifier whenever it's warm. It's warm, but it's cloudy and it's, it's, it's a little windy actually. Since we've been in the forest, it's uh, it's been fine though, so that's at least good. People fishing down here by the pond. People fishing back there too. I guess it's just a day for fishing. Well, I was reading my book outside. Um, then I decided it was a bit chilly. Um, sort of starting to get there, getting pretty. Uh, not cold necessarily, just very, very chilly at night. And so now I'm in here. I was thinking about continuing to read my book, but then I realized, oh yeah, I should probably practice for band for the day. And I've just got Darby in here. So it's kind of cloudy. It looks like maybe it's going to start to rain. I've been reading The Hunger Games because I've, I actually started reading it in eighth grade. We had like this choice reading thing and I had to pick out a book and I started reading it and then I never actually got back to reading it. Like, I only read, like, part of the book, so, you know. Yeah. So now I'm reading that. Since I got plenty of time on my hands, and I've never really been a natural reader. It's weird. Um, but I want to see if maybe I can get into it. Yeah. I guess you just gotta find a book you enjoy. Her TikTok, her cringy TikTok dances again while I play Mario Kart. She's Charlie watching D'Amelio Charlie D'Amelio. Hmm. I need to learn it from her. How nice. Mm -hmm. The whole concept of TikTok dances is just cringy to me. You're on Unpopular TikTok. opinion. Yeah, but I don't do cringy TikTok dances. Neither do I. This is like the first time I've ever done them in my life. So then you are doing them. Oreo is vibing. Vibing in the evening. That's how he rolls. See, he has his pink toy over there. He just chills. Well, folks, I have no new news for you today, and I'll see you tomorrow.